It's kind of a difficult question to answer without having detailed information regarding um, someone's background. Um, the type of course that could be suitable for someone would depend on their budget, um, how much time they have, are they available to take off two weeks or four weeks to attend a training centre, um, and also where they wish to teach. Um, so I would encourage people to read the information on the website, look at the FAQ sections um, and contact us uh, with background information regarding what qualifications they have, what their learning goals are and where they wish to teach. To try and give you a bit of detailed information, a kind of an insight, um, in regards where someone wishes to teach, this can inform which course they wish to take. Um, because the online courses are often seen as an equivalent to the in-class courses in Asian countries. So therefore someone wishing to teach in Asia um, could look towards a 120 hour online course at a minimum to qualify them to teach. Um, but in Europe the online courses aren't so recognised. Um, the in-class courses are much preferred, so anyone wishing to teach in Europe would look naturally towards um, a four-week in-class course or a combined course. Having said that, there's no hard and fast rule that says someone that completes an online course um, cannot gain employment in Europe. We've had many, many online course graduates that have, um, but just to give you some detail there. Um, as you can see, it's quite complicated um, and there's quite a lot involved. So as I said, anyone with this question, please contact us and we will give them some personal assistance regarding this matter.